Sexup guy and welcome back to Akinator! I'm having a lot of fun recording them lately, I don't know why. It's such a simple little concept, but for some reason it's really fun to play. A lot of you seem to really enjoy it as well, which is cool. But look, the last 10 games, you guessed Jack Septiguy and Jack Septiguy. I mean, you guessed John Cena as well. And LD Shadow Lady and Sky vs Gaming is in there. Woo! YouTubers, reigning supreme, which would make sense because we tend to play these kind of things a lot. It's the same with like Eevee and everything. Our names get put into them a lot because we play them and then everyone goes off and asks if they know us, which is cool. It's really flattering. Also, everyone was wondering why my um, Facebook was in French. I have no idea. I'm I'm just on Akinator.com and for some reason I put um, Facebook in French. My Facebook is not in French. I don't speak French. Well, it's a small bit, but not really. It's only from when I, when I was in school. Okay, we're gonna play, um, yeah, 25 as always. Jesus, Akinator, remember my age. It hasn't been that long. I thought you were a genius. Okay, so I have a list of people to guess. Oh, look at that. You can't even see. I'm not giving it away yet. So, the first one we're gonna guess is Evie. Eevee! Eevee! There we go. That's Manly Mannington. Um, is your character a YouTuber? No. Uh, is your character real? No. Did your character wear shoes? Mmm, don't know. Uh, a lot of people are getting mad as well because I wasn't using don't know probably or probably not. Mainly because it just dilutes the answers. It dilutes the questions and everything. Like, saying I don't know kind of makes them just go back and ask a bunch more questions to try and like hone in on it. I'd rather just say yes or no. What the hell is my hair doing? Okay, there we go. <laughs> um, uh, did your character wear shoes? Probably not because she doesn't even have legs. Is your character from a video game? Probably. I, I, it's kind of a character or from a video game. Is your character female? Yes! Technically no, because it's a computer program, but you know what I mean. Is your character an animal? No. Does your character appear in Morrowind? I mean, Evie could be. She could be that evil devil in the sky. Uh, does your character speak Japanese? Don't know. Probably not, actually, because I think it only has like Spanish. English and like French or something so far. I don't think it has Japanese yet. Have you ever talked to your character? Yes. Well, I've tried, but to no avail. Is your character linked to Five Nights at Freddy's? No. Does your character live in New Zealand? No. Is your character from the internet? Yes. Does your character sing and play guitar at the same time? No. I don't know who you're hinting at either. Does your character mostly play in comedies? No. Evie! Oh my god, you got her! Exists or AI? Oh, you clever man. Okay, well that was that one, but now we have to get Billy Boybot. He's new, so I'm hoping that I can break him. Is your character a girl? No. Does your character wear shoes? His name is not Billy, by the way. That's just the name I gave him, because Billy Boybot It's just the way I like to do things. All my names are alliteration. Segway Steve, uh, Billy and Bobby, Wheelchair Willy, Pogo Pete, that, that kind of thing, Helicopter Harry. All those things, uh, except, I don't know, something Betty. I just, Betty seemed like a good name for her. Does your character wear shoes? Probably not. Is your character real? No. Is your character an animal? No. Does your character have hair? Yes. Does your character fight? No. He fights with me, verbally. Does your character stand on two legs? Probably not, because he doesn't have legs. He has nothing above, or nothing below shoulders. Does your character come from the internet? Yes. Does your character wear a hat, cap, crown? No. Is your character a robot? Yes. <laughs> Is your character female? No. I think a boy bot! Oh my god, you got him faster than you got Eevee. God damn it! Okay, well, those are the things that I was hoping you wouldn't get. I probably should have left them to last. Oh god, now we're gonna go on to Shia LaBeouf. <laughs> I don't know why, I, because I thought of those, then I just suddenly thought of memes. So I'm gonna, get, I'm gonna get Shia LaBeouf and see if he gets it. Um, is your character a girl? No. Is your character a real person? He, he is! Shia LaBeouf is as real as they get and he's fucking awesome. Does your character have a child? Don't... And Shia LaBeouf doesn't have a child. I'm gonna say no to that. I'm, I'm pretty confident. Is your character a YouTuber? No. Shia LaBeouf would be an awesome YouTuber. I'd watch that. Wouldn't you watch Shia LaBeouf just go crazy on screen? I oh, know I would. I'm gonna be the, um, uh, surrogate Shia LaBeouf until then. <laughs> I'm gonna be the meme lord. Is your character a singer or does he work with a singer? Uh, probably... Uh, don't know. I don't know if he's... Is your character an actor? Yes. I don't know if he's involved with a singer or anything like that. Probably. He might have done his own, like, album that did terribly and that nobody knows about. Is your character live in America? Yeah. Is your character famous thanks to Disney Channel? Ooh. That's a good question. When I think of Shia LaBeouf now, I think of, like, the actor who's, like, in Transformers and Fury. If it, as, as much shit as people give Shia LaBeouf in general. He's a weird car He's a weird person in real life. He does a lot of weird shit. But... He is a phenomenal actor. 
His his portrayal of I can't remember his name in that movie Fury. If you've ever watched that movie, so good. I actually watched it on the plane on the way to Indie Popcorn, I believe, and it was fucking awesome. I love that movie. I bought it on Blu-ray as well. I actually haven't watched it on Blu-ray since. Got the famous thanks to the Disney Channel. Was even Stevens a Disney thing? I have no idea. I should probably look that up. Even Stevens was a Disney thing. So yes. Is your character in a high school musical? No. He wasn't. I, I would love to hear Shia LaBeouf sing though. I imagine he's great. Probably not. Does your character have a sense of humor? Oh, by Jesus he does. Oh, he's some man for the jokes. Is your character from Jesse? No. <laughs> is your character from Albania? No. Actually, I don't know. Shia LaBeouf. And he- I don't- I, I wouldn't imagine he's like 100% American. I'd imagine he's- he seems to have heritage somewhere else, so I don't know. Does your character have light hair? Mmm, don't know. No. It's darkish. Does your character play the trumpet? Don't know. Does <laughs> your character part of Disney's Frozen? No. Does your character under authority? Under your authority? No. I mean, Shia! You don't speak up unless spoken to! Get back into the slave dungeon! No. Does <laughs> your character have a brother? Man, I don't fucking know. Shia LaBeouf, do you have a brother? If you do, is he as sexy as you are? Shia LaBeouf is one sexy looking man. I'd, 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 I'd let him touch me. <laughs> Not like that! <laughs> I, I meant to, I wanted to steer it away from like a sexual thing. So I was just like, let him touch me, like just poke my face. But then it sounded sexual anyway. Shia LaBeouf brother? He's the only child. No, he doesn't have a brother. His character from the Disney Channel. Yes, I said. His character from a movie. Yeah. His character work in a circus. No. His character from the Disney's movie of the month, Descendants. No. His character have an alter ego named Warfsash. It's not Markiplier. Since when has Mark been a fucking member of the Disney Channel? I mean, I know Disney bought Maker and everything, but that does not mean he's part of the Disney Channel. No. His character fan of AC Milan. I don't, don't know. His character head of state. No. Is your character related to the Transformers franchise? Yes! Ah, oh, there you go! Beard LaBeouf! Shia LaBeard! Sexy man meme lord! Mwah! We love you, Shia! Do it! Whew, that took a long time. Okay, so the next one I have on my list. I'm fucking blasting through these, man. Akinator, you're fucking genius. Get it? Genie. Genius. Okay, we're moving on to Pepe. <laughs> We're going to talk about Pepe, and I have no idea how to answer questions about Pepe. If you don't know what Pepe is, um, you're probably just going to have to look it up. Is that frog meme that you're always seeing everywhere? Actually, is Pepe a frog? I think so. Is character a girl? I don't think Pepe is a girl, and I think Pepe is a guy's name. So no. Is character of a child? <laughs> no. <laughs> is character a YouTuber? No. Is character a real person? No. Does your character stand on two legs? Don't know, because I don't know if Pepe actually has legs. Frogs do. Also, people asked me before, what would happen if you just kept clicking no on everything? I did that before. It just said, a person who says no, or can't make up their mind, or something like that. Is character an animal? Yes. Imagine it just said, Pepe. Is <laughs> character from a TV series for kids? I don't know. See, Pepe could be one of those things that the internet thought up of, and I'm like, no, he's not from anything else. And then I find out he actually had his own TV show ages ago, and that's why he's a meme. I'm just gonna say no. Is your character really short? Yes. Does <laughs> your character have grey hair? No. Sometimes he does. Some of the rarest Pepe's could have grey hair. Is your character afraid of sunlight? Don't know. Is your character from a movie? No. Is your character green? Yes. Now we're good. Is your character associated with a meme? Yes. Is your character handicapped? I don't know. Is your character favourite colour green? Probably. Is <laughs> your character under 10 years old? Don't know. Is your character's mother alive? Don't know. Does your character have four... Have fur and walk on four legs. No, he doesn't have fur. Anyways, I'm just gonna say no to that. Does your character have a famous nickname? Yes. Pepe! There he is! The one and only! The memeiest of all memes! Have you seen the rarest Pepe's? I have the rarest Pepe in all of the world. It's an invisible Pepe. You can't see it. That's what invisible means. Good fucking job. Okay! Last, oh, but certainly not least, we are going for the bobbiest of Rosses right now. Bob Ross, painter man extraordinaire, Afro perm worm motherfucker. Um, so if you haven't realized, Bob Ross has been a thing that's going on on Twitch recently because I think it was the anniversary of his death or his birthday. It might be the anniversary of his death. Yeah, because it was 20 years or something. Um, so Bob Ross was a painter dude who did like really awesome paintings and they started um, doing his shows back to back on Twitch 
and people have just been watching the shit out of him. The chat is hilarious, and there's been like 60,000 people watching him paint pictures of landscapes. He's actually amazing. It's not just like a meme thing. He's literally a fantastic painter. So just go watch him. He's amazing. Um, which character is American? Oh, I actually don't know if Bob Ross is American. I'm gonna just say yes. <laughs> which character is girl? No. Which character currently more than 30 years old? No. He died when he was 52, I think, which is really sad. He died from lymphoma. Um, is your character a YouTuber? No. He's a Twitch streamer now. Is your character a singer? Does he work with a singer? No. Is your character a real person? Yes. Is your character an actor? No. Is your character linked with sports? Painting could be a sport. Famous thanks to the internet. Yes. <laughs> now he is anyway. Is your Bob Ross famous because of a vine? No. He's not linked with video games. Is your character an adult man? Yes. Associated with the Souls game series. No, but those are awesome. This character famous from Facebook. Don't know. This character gay. No. He had a wife, I believe. And a son. His son is awesome too. Does this character work with computers? No. This character black haired. No, no. He has a beautiful brown haired perm and it's slightly silvery as well. Does this character play World's Finals of League of Legends? No. Does this character have a sister? Does Bob Ross have a sister? Bob Ross's sister, Roberta Ross. So I'm just gonna say yes. Character saying Octa hate. No. Character fight with a sword. No. You're getting really far away. This might be good. He might not know this. Character a fashion model. No. Character suffer from short-term memory loss. No. Do you? Character famous because of YouTube. Um. Probably. I mean, he was famous anyway. He was famous on like a PBS. Those kind of things, and he, I remember over here, we had a TV station called TG Carter, which was an Irish station that used to show him all the time. And he, he was popular on that, but he could be famous now because of the internet. Or because of YouTube. Because all his shows went up on YouTube. For free, to go watch. Does character play in the Vampire Diaries? No. Mr. Morg! Oh, Akinator! You silly bitch! You are wrong! Continue? Yes! Character fame linked with something stupid. No, his paintings are majestic. He's not a musician. He's not from a horror genre. I don't know if he has a brother. Does he have a girlfriend? No, he had a wife. I mean, he probably had a girlfriend eventually, but... Is your character married? He was! I don't know if I say yes or no for this. Because it says, is your character married, not was he married. Is your character standing two legs? Yes. Is your character been to Alexandria? Don't know. Is your character currently more than 40 years old? Yes. He died when he was 52, I believe. Is your character a lawyer? No. Is your character dead? Yes. That should really narrow it down now. Is your character from England? No. Is your character a politician? No. Is your character have a child's face? Probably. Bob Ross says, he has a beard and he has that old man face, but it's also very cute. Uh, I'll just say no, because I know that that will probably narrow it down. Is your character wear bandages? No. Is your character a scientist? No. Is your character a TV host? Yes. Is your character have a large nose? Dunno. Is your character a painter? Bob Ross! Look at him! I guess he would have a child's face. Look how cute he is. And those are the paintings that he draws. I mean, you probably know who he is, at least by now, after he went f bloody viral on Twitch. And if you don't know who he is, go watch some of his paintings, because I guarantee you, you will like it. Even if you're thinking, I don't like watching people paint, you will like watching Bob Ross paint. Because not only is he a r fantastic painter and his techniques are insane to watch and see how everything comes together, but he's literally the nicest human being who has ever existed. He is so nice. It's always like, just draw some happy little clouds. We have some trees that live in here. Happy little trees. And he's always like, we don't make mistakes. We just have happy little accidents. There's never any mistakes in his paintings. Just happy little accidents. And then he saves it. And that's what the Twitch chat is. Every time he puts in a tree, it's like, ruined, ruined. And then he puts, he, like he makes the tree look awesome and everyone just says saved in the chat. It's amazing. <laughs> but anyway, that does it for this ep- oh God. That does it for this episode of Akinator. If you liked it, punch the like button in the face! Like a boss! Like a Bob Ross! And I was all around! Thank you guys now and see all your dudes! Has your character ever won the WWE Championship? Felix! Have you ever won the WWE? No, of course he fucking has it. What are all my friends up to? No! Is your character Muslim? Is your charter Muslim? Ah oh, man, I should have said, like a Bob Ross! <laughs> Fuck.